يقول القرآن قرآن سيس أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم سورة بقرة O children of Israel, remember my favors which I have bestowed upon and fulfill my covenant upon you that I will fulfill your covenant upon me and fear nobody except me. And don't mix truth with falsehood or try to conceal the truth while you know it. Then establish prayer and give zakah and bow along with those who are bowing in worship and obedience. Do you order righteousness of the people and forget yourselves while you recite the book? Don't you understand? And seek help with patience and prayer. And indeed, it is difficult except for the humbly submissive to Allah. Those who are certain that they will meet their Lord and, and that they have to return to Him. O children of Israel, remember my favor that I have bestowed upon you and that I prefer raised you over the words. And be fearful the day when no soul will suffice for another soul at all, nor will intercession will be accepted from anybody nor any compensation will be taken from anybody, nor will they be added. And remember, when we saved your forefathers from the people of Pharaoh, who was afflicting you with the worst torment, they were slaughtering your newborn sons and were keeping your females alive, and in that verily was a great trial from your Lord. And remember when we parted the sea for you and saved you and drowned the people of the Pharaoh while you were looking them. And remember, when we called Moses for forty nights, then you took for worship the calf after him in his absence, and you were the wrongdoers. Then we forgave you after that, so that perhaps you would be grateful. And remember when we gave Moses the book scripture and criterion that perhaps you would be guided. And remember when Moses said to his people, O oh, my people, indeed you have wronged yourselves by taking the worship of calf. So repent to your Lord and kill yourselves that is best for you in the sight of your Lord. Then he accepted your repentance. Verily, he is accepting of repentance, the merciful. And remember when you demanded to Moses and said, O Moses, we will never believe you until we see Allah with our own eyes. So the thunderbolt took you while you were seeing it. Then we revived you after your death, so that you may be grateful. And we gave you the shed of clouds, and we sent down man and salva. Eat from the pure things which we have provided you. And they wronged us not, but they were only wrong, wronging themselves. And remember when we said, Enter the city and eat from it wherever you will in ease and abundance, and enter the gate bowing humbly, and say, Hitta, relieve us of our burdens. We will then forgive your sins for you, and we will increase the doers of good in goodness and reward. But those who are wrong to us change those words to the words other than that, which had been said to them. So we sent down upon those wrongdoers a punishment from the sky, because they were defiantly disobeying. And remember when Moses prayed for water for his nation. So we said, Strike the stone with your staff. And there gushed forth from it twelve springs. And every people of each tribe knew its watering place. Eat and drink from what Allah has provided you. And do not commit abuse on earth spreading corruption. And remember when you said, O oh Moses, we can be patient with only one foot. So call upon your Lord to bring forth for us from the earth its green herbs, and its cucumbers, and its garlic, and its lentils, and its onions. Moses said, Do you want to exchange what is better for what is less? Go into any settlement and deed, you will have what you have asked. And they were covered with humiliation and poverty and returned with wrath of Allah upon them. It was because they repeatedly disbelieved in the signs of Allah and killed the prophets without any right. It was because they disobeyed and were habitually transgressing. Verily those who believed and those who were Jews and Christians and Sabians before Prophet Muhammad whosoever among them believed in Allah in the last day and did good deeds for their rewards is with their Lord and no fear will there be concerning them nor will they grieve. And remember when we took the covenant from you and we raised over you the mount, saying, Hold fast what we have given you and remember what is in it, that perhaps you may become righteous. Then you turned away after that. And if favor and mercy of Allah had not been upon you, you would have been among the losers. And you already known about those who transgressed among you concerning the Sabbath. 
and we said to them, Be absent, despised, and rejected. And we made it an exemplary punishment for those who were present and those who succeeded them, and a lesson for those who fear Allah. And remember when Moses said to his nation, Indeed, Allah commands you to slaughter a cow. They said, Do you make fun of us? He said, I seek refuge in Allah from being among the ignorant. They said, Call upon your Lord to make clear to us what it is. Moses said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, It should be a cow which is neither too old, neither too young, but median between that. So do what you are commanded. They said, Call upon your Lord again to show us what should be color of her. Moses said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, It should be a yellow colored cow, bright in its color, pleasing to the observers. They said, Call upon your Lord again to make clear to us what it is. Indeed, all cows look alike to us. And indeed, we, if Allah wills, will be guided. Moses said, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, It is a cow which is neither trained to plow the earth nor to irrigate the field, free from fault, with no spot on her. They said, Now you have come with the truth. So they slaughtered her, but they could hardly do it. And remember when you killed a man and disputed over it, but Allah was to bring out that which you were concealing. So he said, Strike the slain man with the part of it, the cow. Thus does Allah bring the dead to life, and he shows you his signs that you might understand and ponder upon them. Then your hearts became hardened after that, being like stones or even harder. For indeed there are stones from which rivers burst forth, and there are some of them that split open and water comes out of it. And there are some of them stones that fall down in fear of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And Allah Azawajal is not unaware of what you do. Do you covet hope, O believers, that they should believe for you while a group of them used to hear the words of Allah and then distort, corrupt, change Torah, words of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala after they had understood it while they were knowing? And when they meet those who believe, they say, We have believed. But when they are alone with one another, they say, do you talk to them, Muslims, about what Allah has revealed to you, so they can argue with you about it before your Lord? Then will you not reason? But do they not know that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala knows what they conceal and what they declare? And among them are unlettered ones who do not know the scripture except in wishful thinking, but they are only assuming. So woe to those who write the scripture with their own hands. They say this is from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in order to exchange it for a small price. Woe to them for what their hands have written, and woe to them for what they earn. And they said, Fire will never touch us, except for a few days. Say, Have you taken a covenant from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala? For Allah jalla shanahu will never break his covenant, or do you say about Allah azawajal that which you don't know? Yes, why not? Whosoever earns evil and his sin has encompassed him, they are the people of fire, and they will abide there forever. And as for those who believe and do righteous deeds, those are people of paradise, they will abide there forever. Sadaqallahul Azim.